guys, it's Nikia Nichelle with Chicago Tribune's ChicagoNow.com. Someone is trying to get me tipsy tonight. It's my girl. Okay. <laughs> that don't listen to a word she just said. You, you, she's gonna take the ownership today. Look, I coined you as the first lady of entertainment. Okay. <laughs> I love you for that. Oh my God, oh my, God. my husband doesn't compliment me like that. So thank you for saying that. You've created your own wine, yes. XOG. Uh -huh. Let's talk a little bit about that. How do you first of all decide to create a wine? What goes into that? Woo, a lot goes into it. I had heard about this really cool technology of these four stackable glasses that make up a bottle of wine and they're shatterproof. And you know, and I just thought they're so perfect for the woman who at the end of the day just wants one, maybe two glasses of wine, but feels like I don't want to open a whole bottle of wine because I might waste it, it's such a waste. So I thought it was just so brilliant. And I reached out to the company and I said, I would love to do a wine with you. And I grew up with wine. I grew up in an Italian family. I just have always loved wine. And it's always been a dream of mine. And that's how it came about. And so we called it XOG because that's how I sign off on everything I do. Emails, Twitter, or, you know, Instagram. I'm always writing XOG, and I thought, why not call it XOG? Do you get to be actually in the lab while they're making the wine and to say, and eh, not so good? Oh uh, yeah, I'll that's a pass. You. I'll tell you. So this wine is so good, okay, that we actually get it from France and Italy. So I'm not there, but we did have a lot of tastings, a lot, which was like my favorite part of the whole process. <laughs> but what's so funny is we would. Uh, when we were developing the wine and coming up with with everything, we, you know, they would send us these bottles to our house with no label on them, just like a number and a sharpie. And I would be so excited, I'd be opening them up, and Bill would go, "You have no problem just drinking from unidentified bottles, like no label, nothing. You don't even know what's in there. Who packed this thing?" I'm like, "We're good," yeah. you know. And so it was fun. Bill helped me, my friends helped me, and we would really narrow down. Um, you know, what we loved and what we didn't like and until we found the perfect wine. So you were the bandit of getting everyone tipsy. <laughs> so we've, we've uncovered that clue. She is still trying to point the finger at me. She likes the wine. I don't need to get her to drink the wine. I, you know, we only launched XOG a year ago. Oh, wow. And I think this year, I just heard a statistic the other day. I believe it's the, uh, like it was the fastest growing new wine in 2015. So it's really taken off, especially with women, especially with millennials love it, uh, because it's portable. You can, you know, women are sending me pictures on Twitter, like, look, here's a picture of me sneaking it into the movie theater. I'm like, shh, you know, I, I can't like market that, but go ahead. Uh, but women come up with all these places that they bring it and they're always sharing it with me. And it's cool, because it's shatterproof and portable and, it's just fun to, especially for the woman on the go, an active woman. Now, is it interchangeable? So let's say you wanted a Pinot Grigio with a rosé or a Moscato. Can you like mix and match it? So I'll tell you. So what a lot of women do, especially right now with the holidays, people are having holiday parties. So they'll buy a handful of bottles and they'll just, you know, snap them off and they keep them around the table. So if you have guests who want Pinot Grigio, if you have guests who want Pinot Noir, rosé, Moscato, you don't have to buy a bunch of all those bottles. You can buy these and just separate them and keep them around the table. We do have a mix pack. Okay. So this is the one oh, mix pack. Okay. So it's a two Pinot Grigio and two Pinot Noir. Okay, and so what's the price point? Cause you know, wines can get a little expensive and yes, break the can. pocket. And you know, at home moms, they wanna turn up a little. <laughs> yes, we do. I'm a mom. I know all about turning up. Uh, $11. Eleven dollars, so yeah. Super affordable. Super affordable. Uh, when you break it down, that's what less than three dollars for a glass of wine, and uh, and it's delicious wine. You know, this wine was actually meant. I will tell you, when we sourced the wine and created this wine, this was at a price point of fifteen dollars, and because we were able, we did so well with it so quickly, and we had so much volume, we were able to bring the price to eleven. So really, what's in this? the juice as we call it the juice is a 15 dollars juice for 11 dollars oh, okay. 
So it's a steal. So pick up your wine um, and, and just, you know, get tipsy with Juliana a little bit. Um, we look forward to seeing it in Mariano's and what yes. other places can they pick it up? Love Mariano's. Mariano's has been so good to us. We absolutely love Mariano's in Wisconsin. There's Roundy's has it. Also uh, Walmart. I think 3,000 Walmarts around the, the country have it. And then we're expanding into Australia and hopefully the UK next year. And we're in Canada now. And it's, it's moved very fast um, in a very short amount of time, which is really exciting. And I'm just happy. You know, I'm just happy that women love it, that women come out and say, you know, every woman I meet who knows the wine, they're like, it tastes delicious, it's so much fun, it's my favorite wine, I can bring it places with me, it's a great hostess gift, it's a great holiday stocking stuffer. Uh, so it's just been, I do a lot of cool things and this is probably, you know, the coolest thing I do. Well, let's cheers to that. Thank you. Cheers. cheers. Congratulations to a great wine. Thank you. Hey guys, it's Juliana Rancic here, and every time I'm in Chicago, you better believe I love hanging out with Nakia Nichelle. Why wouldn't I look at her drinking wine? This is why this girl likes to have fun.